Hey everyone, today we're doing something different. This is kind of letting my parents know I'm alive and documenting an assignment for school. So what I got here is a tool bag. Because I got some tools for one of my courses on ODU. It's IT3, it's a 300 course. It's Intro to Network Security and so the tools I got are this cut over here, it's a different brand, but then all this came together. This is a crimping, cutting tool for RJ45 connectors. We're going to be making a patch cable today. Following a video, I'm documenting what I'm going to do. Got category 6E cable. You can see how I uh, cut it away a bit. You can see you can cut and you can strip away. So what we need to do is to attach these to the rest of this. So this will be attempt one. I am going off a of video that our professor provided. We go to our tool bag. We get the wire cutter that are not on brand. They were a different brand, just not the same as the bag. Go to the biggest hole, put it in here, close it, and just give it a twist. Here we go. Maybe ease up. All right, there we go. And this little baby right here, you can see there are. Uh, these copper bits on the end, they want to match up, they want to be flush coming out of here. So don't strip your finger to the bone. That would not be good. Unless you're a cyborg. You don't want to just have plain wire. That'd be a big no-no. Especially if it's not insulated. Because you don't want to shock yourself and die as has been stressed to me by my dad who is an electrical engineer and they go everywhere just like the video said we, we want the uh, jacket that's the uh, inside coating to go into this little thing and not we don't want it to be hanging out because these exposed wires will leak the signal into each other and that's called crosstalk as if oh man literally having your wires crossed not good that's how we do it the color of the rainbow slide it in here get it into grooves that feels right so we're gonna try it yeah, that's not in the grooves at all. So, for sure, attempt number two is going to come up. And maybe they aren't in there. Let me double check if these. We did get another bag. And I thought that was just for twisting them together. Do I need to add anything else to the here are the lanes? How could they stay in their lanes if they didn't have the lanes? We're going to try it, putting it in first for a few times, but we might switch to putting them in their lanes and then switching them. Okay, here's proof of concept. I had a proof of concept. Proof of concept, I can slide a wire into the sled right here. You just got to get them right. Alright, okay, so our backwards hypothesis has been proven correct. Just gonna keep on looking at it. Alright. I said this video was to show my parents that I'm still alive and doing well. It's easy to forget to test your mommy when you live away from them, but make sure you text your mommy if you live away from your mommy. She wants to know how you're doing, and she doesn't 
want to have to ask. And so, this will be a, a way of showing them that I'm alive and doing well and have the mental capacity to be in a 300 level college course and I need to update my dad about stuff because I've talked to him about this course because it's cool that it's so similar that you're overlap with what he does which is a lot of working with wires Alright, I can fully appreciate the magnifying glass he has downstairs in his workstation area. Uh, quick call to action for those. They aren't doing tedious wire work, but it is my voice, my ideas. Playing the binding of Isaac after birth plus which is weird to mention in a video where I talk about my parents and uh oh did we do it no and Pokemon trading card game online Alright, we're learning. We're getting there. We have a method of lining the wires up, and we're trying to get them into this sled here, as they call it. Yeah, my dad has always been the expert on wiring and stuff. I can remember, is that right, him and my brother trying to get a PlayStation 1 hooked up to our TV. And for some reason they had to go through a hole downstairs. I can't even comprehend that. It's a lot easier nowadays. Try it again. Attempt 489. Oh, we got something. We got something. White, orange, orange, white, blue, white, green, blue, green, white, blue. See, it's messed up, but we're making progress, as you can see. It's making it a lot easier. I can show you guys, I got all the wires in, but you can laugh, because they're not all evenly spaced out. There's a bimodal distribution of these wires. Brings me to another thing I like. Let me, hold on. Which is statistics, which is another, you know, not exactly cool guy thing to like, but I like it. So we will continue after becoming slightly unflustered, wrong end. Here's the end we're working on. How are we looking? Put it on nice and snug. And do it in the right orientation and we snap it together. Push it out, it did it again. Okay. Goodbye. Alright. We will soon know them like we know the books of the Bible, Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Joshua, Dad of Ruth, Fresh and Second Samuel. 1st and 2nd Kings, 1st and 2nd Chronicles, Ezra, Nehemiah, Esther, Job, Psalms, Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, Song, Solomon, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel, Daniel, Hosea, Joel, Amos, Obadiah, Jonah, Micah, Nahum, Habakkuk, Zephaniah, Haggai, Malachi, White, orange, orange, white, green, blue, white, blue, green, white, brown, brown, Matthew, Mark, Luke, John, Acts, Romans, first and second Corinthians, first and, no, 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 first and second Corinthians, Galatians, Ephesians, Philippians, Colossians, first and second Timothy, Titus, Philemon, Hebrews, 
James. Don't switch to the Apostle song in the middle of it and say John. That's coming, but it's first and second Peter. First and second and third John, Jude, and Revelation. And there's no S in the end of Revelation. Alright. For some reason, it keeps on pulling out. Okay. Getting torn up. Maybe we should do it like this. Get snug in there. And squeeze. And then pop it out. Pop it out. Ah, uh, this is not what you want. We got that dreaded crosstalk because you can see some of the wires is just sliding up. Well, it's been crimped now, but it's just sliding off. I wonder if we can recrimp. No, it just came out. Okay, well. It's really easy now, but we need to get these flushes the hard part. It's part of the different skill set than Binding of Isaac or Pokemon trading card game. And Pokemon the trading card game. And it's that gonna work? Requires a different skill set than the handheld Pokemon games. Ah, they're not exactly flush. I thought these would come out. The end. Do they not come out the end until the crimp came off? Okay. What are you gonna call this video? Straight crimping with video junkie? I made that joke, but it might be the title. It's not a it's not a video log with video junkie. It's not a vlog, it's just a log composed of audio visual elements with video junkie. Okay, I think they're flush. And we're ready to be crimped. Don't mess it up. I almost messed it up. Yikes. We've done it. We've done it. It is crimped. The wires might not be flush, I'm not sure how to test it, but it looks a lot like how it originally came. This is the original, professionally made, bought at Walmart. I'm not sure if those two attributes go together. Here is mine. And if you want to see the other other end, here's that. Can you spot the difference other than the... More pronounced connector. I don't know. We'll see. I will take pictures of this and for further documentation because I don't know how my professor wants to prove that I did it. Probably not in a YouTube video. I'm just having this for fun. So, what have we done? We took one of these types of wires. Got it caught on a chair. We took one of these types of wires. This is a patch cable. RJ. Four five connector. I'm getting these mixed up. We took this patch cable, a Cat E Cat Six E Ethernet cable, or maybe just Cat Six. I think I think the Six E has a few different things. Cat Six patch cable. We used the wire. We used wire cutter and strippers to take it down to. Like we're doing a repair for if one of the wires got damaged. And we attached another RJ45 connector with our RJ45 crimping tool. And we had a lot of fun question marks. I guess that's up to you. So now we have our complete cable. And we didn't take too much off of it. 
we probably took uh, like six inches off of it so we learned some we assembled the connector by fitting wires like these in the correct order that's white orange orange white green blue white blue green white brown brown into a little sled which went into the connector which got put in the crimping machine and crimped and we messed it up like two or three times so that's what we did for today if you like what you see in this kind of different style of content then subscribe to my channel I'm not sure I might do more stuff like this it's kind of fun just to talk about stuff don't call it a vlog um, as I said before I also upload the Binding of Isaac videos and Pokemon Trading Card Game Plus videos and me and my wife just played Armello and I edited that together a bit I've discovered that I kinda like editing so be on the lookout for that, that'll be coming out soon if you really really want to see stuff hit the bell icon uh, if you like this video for some weird reason I'm not looking for likes this video but I got, it'd be nice to know if you did like it and if it made you smile, if it made you feel any emotion whatsoever, share this video with your friends and family and whoever you want to share those specific emotions with. That'll be it for today, folks. Goodbye.